All right, here we go. Go back real quick. Wait, go back? Uh, no, turn to your left. Oh, okay, it was just coat hangers. It looked like there were, like, letters or something in it, but... Act 2, the hunt! So we got to Act 2. Okay. Alright, well, that, that happened. Is it going to take us back to the, uh... That's my question. Is it going to take us back to the cabin? If it doesn't, let's back out of the game yeah. and see. Because I feel like it's getting us further and further in. But this is how Layers of Fear was. There wasn't, like, a lot of, like, enemies or things like that. It was more exploring, learning the story, that kind of idea. Can I go back at all? I can. But the door is locked. Okay, so it loaded up a new section of the game. Yeah. Alright, so let's quit. Like we were saying. And see if it'll... Uh... Yeah, see if it'll let us... Um, jump in. Whether it loads us up in our cabin. Or... What? So, yeah. from what we know so far is... Lily and her are assumed brothers and si brother and sister. Yeah. They ran away from home, is what it seems, and they're stowed away on this ship. Probably their parents brought them on the ship and they stowed away. Um, because they didn't want to be at home with their parents anymore. Maybe they were abused, something. Home life was bad, because she's like, they'll send us back. Um... She's more brave than he is. She's, you know, trying to make the best of a bad situation. She's watching out for him. Yeah, okay. They're pretending to be on, like, this pirate adventure and yeah. hiding and... Oh, it doesn't send us back. Okay. Maybe it'll just naturally... Maybe a doorway will lead us there. Eventually, yeah. If not, it's kind of weird if it's, like, they give you this starting room that you never go back to. Oh, we're back. This is our starting room. There we go. Because here's our bathroom. Yep. Um, I figured, like, eventually... It had to, yeah. yeah. Hey. So, character put the mask on. And... Re... Scarach. Show your face. I mean, that spells out... Character. It almost spells out characters. Or character. Show your face, but it's missing another A. Right? Yeah. Show your true face. Put the mask on. Interesting. Is this the same? No, this is different. Inside every actor is the one part they were born to play, the one character they were meant to build. Chip away the bloody marble, give form to the formless, until all that remains is the truth. So, that's what we know of him so far. Heard you got off to a rough start. I know you have your idea of who the character should be. It's your right. You're the star of the show. Just remember, the director might be an odd duck, but at the end of the day, you're on the same team. And then we know that he apparently has some issues... With this, ships, for some reason. Yep, and just some personal uh, things. And then his director is also uh, an interesting one. So this shows what looks to be a dock. Yeah, that's a dock. Yep. Uh, with the ship. Yep, side of the ship. It's like some a people. kid or a person, yeah. And then this one, if we pull it out one, shows everybody boarding the ship. So Crowd. maybe it's us boarding the ship, the actor. Yeah, because it looks like some of them either have like cameras they're holding up, or yeah, those are they're holding up some type of camera because those are the flash bulbs. Yep. Yeah, so it's a big crowd watching him get on the ship. And then our original picture is the ship. It looks like it's in flames, but that could just be because the film is so destroyed, which it could serve both purposes. Either in flames or it's a bunch of water that's like overwhelming. Uh... Alright, 
So we already listened to Canister 1, right? Yeah. Cause... This was the test? Yep. So Canister 2... Okay. Okay. Few things have changed, it seems, for better or worse. Children playing in the streets, not a care in their little minds. If it wasn't for their shabby clothes, one could almost forget about the crushing poverty that uh -huh, plagues uh -huh. so many of the local families. But what do we have here? A boy sitting on a park bench alone. Perhaps he won't mind if we pick his brain a bit. Wow, that was a long film. Name? Good morning, young man. What's your good morning? Good man. Your morning. What's your name? James. Oh. We got a name. Maybe we have a name. Maybe this is James. Because you notice it said in the in the subtitles, when it said morning, it wasn't spelled like morning, it was spelled like your mourning the loss of someone yeah it's like good man you're mourning what's your name james so maybe his name is james yeah so it looks like him and his sister were two poor kids that stowed away on this big fancy ship yep that would make sense and looking like they probably got caught or something happened for his sister likely to uh what is that uh... Well, it's gone now. I think it looked like a little mini. It looked boat. like a little boat, right? I think it's gonna show up right here. Hey, this is a little wood boat. Okay. If only fishing was that easy. <laughs> hey, look, we got paintings. It's our posters. Yeah. Now notice. That autograph. It's the same one. Yep. So these have to be our films. Yep. It looks like we might have missed one. Yeah, I don't know if it meant to be spaced out like that or yeah. If there well, was... it looks like each black line is where oh. a poster would have been. Yep. So a... we we obviously yep. don't have this one. So I'm curious if because that was the first one we found. That was the second. Yeah, Wonder if we missed the one in the middle. Yep. It's looking like that. Okay. That's good to know. What the fuck? Is that a dolphin? What is that? Some kind of... Whatever it is, I don't like it. Uh, the theater was upstairs, right? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, look. That's not a... That's the hole we could look through. Now oh, there's a note on the mirror now. Oh, shit. I missed that. Build the character. Motivation. What drives me? What do I want? What do I need? What are my virtues? Crossed out. My flaws? Who crossed it out? What hunts? Crossed out. Haunts me. What haunts me? This guy's got a lot of issues. Yeah. Which one of these is tape one? Oh, so that's act one. So there must be four acts. Yeah. Okay. So this is act two. The hunt. The hunt. Which is probably not a good sign. <laughs> How far can he go? Uh-huh, uh-huh. How deep can he descend? Pretty deep. I can go pretty deep. The thing he seeks is still there. Buried. the deer again a prison of himself burning deer he tries he must like jerky god i could go for some jerky yeah hungry and we got some ants it knows it needs it acts next time we do a long day like this we should have snacks prepared like skittles and jerky that would have been the logical thing to have done these and so but, we must hey. leave the stillness of the mind and brave the storm of teeth and claws. Teeth and claws. Only then 
Santa Claus. Let me find the key. Okay. His prize. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I feel like there's better ways to uh, teach acting. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe a teensy bit. Just. Yeah. Oh, here we are. Act two, the hunt. Yep. We've officially oh, got the... Oh, my leg! Uh... Oh, my leg! Sweet <laughs> Jesus! Oh! Not like going on the hunt with your legs asleep. Oh, yeah! Oh! Oh, yeah, that feels better. So I'm curious if it's going to be the same... Oh, okay. Sweet Lord. Oh, I know what we need to do real quick. Um, we will be our B in a mom. All righty. Back we go. Had to change the controller. Yeah. Before you die while you're running to a... Right. Whatever's about to hunt you. That's similar. Okay. Do your balls hang low? Do the drag upon Excuse me. I'm such a big fan. Could you please sign... Oh, I, I, I'm sorry. I, I think I mistook you for someone else. Ooh. Wow. Are you not my, you're not my fan? How dare you? Okay. Everybody's my fan. Apparently we're not as big as we thought we were. I guess. That does not sound pleasant. Nope. All I gotta say is I really hope it's a deer that starts chasing you. Really? Yeah. A deer? That would just be the most hilarious thing. Notice we keep going down the same hallway. Yeah. I'm just saying because it's called the hunt. <laughs> so you know something's gonna start chasing you. That's true. That would be funny. <laughs> it's like, you expect like the big shadow thingy again or something. No, nope, it's the deer. Ooh, a camera. Yeah. Old school uh, camera. Could we take this again? Uh, <laughs> there's something wrong with the picture. Is it my face? I, I think you must have moved. Are you trying to insult my face? Just don't look quite yourself. What are you trying to say, random guy? I don't look myself, and she mistook me for someone else. Interesting. Is it the depression? Hi! Bye! <laughs> nope. Just gonna stay in this room until the end of time. Oh. oh. I hate hark hark! Are you sure there's something wrong with me and not you? <laughs> uh, okay, let's try to leave this room now. Just pretend like that room doesn't exist anymore. Right. That's it, door number three! A lot of blood. Oh shit. Is that blood? Or is that water? Maybe it's water. Yeah, maybe it's just... I feel like it's supposed to be blood. Yeah. My first instinct is definitely blood. But the floor color doesn't help with determining... Uh... Well, the fact it's going to that creepy-ass door... I'm gonna go blood. That's the guy who hunts us, isn't it? It looks like it. I don't like the way he's twitching back and forth. What? Oh god damn it! Oh no, that's the guy. <laughs> no. Yeah. You notice he has like a vagina chest? Yeah. What are they trying to say? Vaginas are creepy to this guy? To <laughs> Not to me, but to <laughs> it is. Yeah. Okay, so yes, this is the man who chases us. The question is, do we need to backtrack or keep going forward? Uh, jump! Um, oh, good, I'm alive. Okay. <laughs> I was worried. You're dead. <laughs> I know. You know, jumping down an elevator shaft can always... uh. Full steam ahead. When chasing dreams, we often find ourselves. 
Oh, I forgot to look up to see if that was Candyman. Oh, yeah. You want to do that for me while we're doing this? Yes. Did that not go down all the way? Why didn't you go down? What is Le Rome? Do I have to plug you in somewhere else? Maybe there? Hey, I did it. What? I saw the lines coming back up and I was like, that's not good. I did not like all those white lines coming down. I was like, oh, we're gonna die. Anything good in here? Yes, a note. All right. Starting patrol of lower decks. Engine room appears to be in order. Moving through the cargo holds. Heard suspicious noise amongst the cargo. Went to investigate. Flashlight broke. Had to double back to get a spare. Line circled in red. Damage to company property. Deduct from pay. Derecollation of duty. Recommend disciplinary action. Resuming patrol. No further signs of disturbance. Shift over. So that must be from the guy who was investigating us. Yep. Yeah. Is it the guy? Uh, I'm trying to find anything that'll really list. Oh, just search the Candyman movie and click on his profile and see if he's listed. True. Got more creepy mannequins, David. Nope. That's a whole lot of nope. Hey, look, he's afraid now. He wasn't afraid a moment ago. I feel like... The hunt refers to the big thing hunting us. I feel like this uh, act is going to be a lot more running and a lot less puzzle solving. Yeah. But we'll see what happens. Oh, here we go. Ow, 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 ow! Apparently steam killed me, which... Steam would do that, so... Yeah. Steam can cut you in half. Death is a fearful thing. It's terrifying. Where did it load me up? Oh, good. I can see... I can look up where the mannequin saw... The guy... No, I didn't see anything. Where do I go? What is this? Doesn't look like it. He sounds so much like him. That's interesting. Or at least it doesn't have anything listed for... Doesn't have him listed or nothing? Alright, so last time this popped... Been and now it's done. Oh, no, this says it is. It is? Yeah, this article says it is narrated by him. Nice. All the food disappeared. Well, now what am I gonna eat? Alright. Well, that's cool. So I'm just gonna imagine this is a Candyman game that we're being chased around by him. Yeah. So now, at least you won't have to go the whole game wondering, like, is that actually him? So yeah, they actually got him to do the narration. That's cool. They're apparently doing a reboot of that movie, hmm. of uh, Candyman. Uh, I think they said Jordan Peele wanted to do it. Interesting. Which would be really cool. But I think they... S Whoa! I think he wasn't contact the the original actor yeah was not contacted to redo it and he was like a little disappointed but at the same time he's like i wish them all the best but it sucks yeah i hope they at least give him like a cameo or something because you would think he made that role his he was a terrifying guy although i always preferred the first movie to the second the second movie was a bit like 
stereotypical 90s rough. Mm. There's there's like a 10 year period, 10 to 12 year period where horror movies had a very specific like 90s early 2000 feel. And it's just not a good feeling. Yeah, I think everything kind of has those moments where there's Late. usually yeah, there's usually like the one thing that comes out then everything else ends up feeling the same. Um um well, I tried to lock him out. I mean late 90s early 2000 feels definitely had that cuz it was like their cameras were getting more HD but everything tried to have like an anti-establishment like new metal kind of feel to it. Like, I just rewatched Freddy vs. Jason, and that movie epitomizes that feeling. Like, it's kind of shitty CG that they're trying to throw into the movies because computer graphics weren't great yet. Alright, now turn. Yeah. Turn That's what I was turn. trying to do, but the door kept opening. Now, where do I go? You might just have to wait for him to give up, maybe? Maybe? I don't, I don't know, because there's really nowhere for me to go. Oh, I think he gave up. Well, we could just stay here and die. But, like, the first Scream movie is, like, right before that happened, but then Scream 2 and 3, you can definitely feel it. Freddy vs. Jason, I Know What You Did Last Summer, yeah. um... There's definitely no denying, like, when you see the movies that fell in that time frame, like, there's no mistaking it for, like, a different period. Oh, almost had the door. Ooh, keys. Can I grab any of these keys? Oh. They threw you off. Maybe it had to be on the key for the key to appear. There is another door, though. I saw it. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Maybe this one isn't, uh... It's weird, because it's, like, showing up, and then it's... Not? Huh. And it has, like, music, like there's something happening. Well, this room also didn't seem to load right. And I don't know if that's because we broke the game by standing in that room. Or if that's just the intentional look of that room. Yeah. Because everything else seems fine. I don't know, because we don't have flashlights or anything anymore. Well, we never had them in this game, but... I feel like this room didn't load properly. just not going for the right door or are, are we assembling the door piece by piece maybe uh yeah because part of it did seem to stick around whenever you were uh yep yep uh -huh. makes more sense yep need the door frame There we go. That was cool. It took a little thinking, but that was yeah. cool. It was something different, but, like, you know, it used the same premise as before. I mean, why would you just ring a bell like that? Well, that's the deck we were down on before. Yeah. But why would you tell a certain creepy monster that you're here? Right. But the movies back then definitely had that weird... Because, like, computer graphics weren't great. Yeah. And they were all trying to use them. Well, especially after... You know, Jurassic Park, everybody wanted to have something that looked that good, but wanted to be able to do it all on the computer. Well, Jurassic Park, for the most part, 
used practical other than yeah. a couple of small instances. Yeah. They were very small. Yeah. But the ones they did do were looked really, really well, well done. Well, yeah. Looked really good. So because it was that nice combo of CG and real puppets. Yeah. Okay. Can I grab that heart? No, can I? Gotta turn on the TV. Grab the heart. Why do I feel like Candyman is like the director? That's my assumption right now, since he seems to be the one continually, uh... When everybody keeps saying the director puts you through like weird motions. Yeah. He might be a little crazy, but just trust him. Yeah, he said the heart, but I can't grab it. I wondered if I zoomed in on it and looked at it for a little bit. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. But. Okay. Almost there. Or is that part two of this? That's part two? Yeah. Oh, then yeah, we're, we're good on time then. So we'll pick this up in the next episode. See if we can figure out what's going on. <laughs> yeah, I'm still curious why it wouldn't let me pick up this heart. Yeah, I don't know if it's something you gotta go back for. Or... I don't know, maybe. But we'll figure it out next time, everybody. Bye. Hey.